Got a package in the mail today. Oh, there it is. Nice. So yeah, there's my Luna Odd Eye Circle design. I actually designed this one right on my computer here. Using Photoshop, I put all this stuff here. If you didn't already know, I design, mod, and create many, many arcade sticks. This is one of them. This is my BOA arcade stick. It has my name engraved right there on the plexiglass. This is old and dusty now because I haven't played on PS2 in a while, but as you can see there. Another of the hundreds of arcade sticks I've modded is this Quanba, a stock template here. This is my 21 arcade stick that I brought to the 21 concert. Uh, sadly, I didn't get it autographed. I eventually swapped it out for this Katy Perry one that I designed just because, you know, Katy Perry was hot at the time. Oh, this is actually... Oh, okay. This arcade stick is compatible with PS3, PS4, Xbox, Xbox One, PC, all that fun stuff. Now, since this is one of the cheaper May flashes, they don't make plexiglass for it. The only way to mod this with artwork is to make a sticker. Okay, there we go. And then right before we slap the artwork on, I can clean it with the microfiber. Actually, I probably don't have to take these off. Let's check out and see what's underneath the hood. Just bought a brand new tool set too, so I am souped. Ah! We're gonna have to take all the buttons and the joystick out before we put the template on. Oh, oh, moment of truth. Wow, very nicely organized. I like that. I also gotta unscrew the joystick, the metal pieces and all that to come off. It's a green. There's a green again. Okay, that's confusing. There's literally two of every color. I don't know why. Usually it's eight different colors, but uh, I'm about to figure that out. Yeah, there's tabs on the side here. You can just hold it in and it comes off just like that. Then you can just pull these two wires right off the tabs right there. Four screws should do it for the joystick. Should pop right out. Oh, I forgot. Got to take out the freaking ball top too. Flathead against the uh, this part right here. There right, we go. Hold the flathead against it. And the ball top comes off. Oh! Now we can take the joystick completely out. I ended up labeling all the wires because I didn't want to get confused. So, because literally every other joystick has uh, gray, black, purple wires. But for some reason, this only has four colors twice. And one last button. This actually came out really good. Gonna be tough. Oh, nice. It's not super sticky. I got another package in the mail today. Sanwa joystick. Something brand new that I've never had before. I wanted to try that out. And there's new metallic Sanwa buttons. I've never seen these. These are brand new, so I want to try these out as well. Also, metallic ball tops are brand new as well. I've never seen these, so this looks really cool. And I believe this is also metallic gun black. That's also new. That's it. Dust washer, shaft cover. We just screw it right in. Once again, flat head right in there. Tighten it a little bit right there. That way it's not loose as you're playing the game. I just stick it wherever you want. Click, it's done. Okay? And look at that. It's alive. Yes. Everything works.